all members of Joint Task Force 629. Today I'm not only talking to you as your commander, but also as a father and a husband. Today we are facing a threat that Australia has not seen in recent history. It is a threat that has occupied our country. It is invisible and it's impacting our lifestyles. Our mission is to provide authorised defence support to all states and territories to assist them as they address the COVID-19 crisis. I'm privileged and honoured to be the commander of Joint Task Force 629 and I look forward to leading you as we work as part of the whole of government team to address this crisis. Already our deployed personnel have undertaken planning activities and contact tracing, which is important to health authorities to help them understand the spread of the virus within our communities. We are also providing quarantine compliance monitoring alongside our police partners. This includes at hotels, where hundreds of Australians are completing their 14-day mandatory quarantine after returning from overseas. We are doing the same at major commercial ports to ensure the quarantine measures supporting the arrival of commercial shipping is not breached. Rest assured, your health and the health of your families and that of the Australian public is at the forefront of my thoughts. We are taking every measure possible to provide you protection. I want to personally thank you and your families for your service during this COVID-19 pandemic. I'm very proud of what the JTF has been able to achieve thus far as we work closely with our state and territory colleagues. And I'm confident that we'll continue to do so as we work together to address the impact of the pandemic until we can return to normalcy. Keep up the outstanding work.